All right, so tomorrow whoa, we... Whoa, 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 whoa. You are jumping way into it. What? You're supposed to welcome everyone to your channel. How... See, I have to be involved with this because the last time we, we did a vlog, or you did a vlog, it was okay. <laughs> I rated it maybe... Uh, mid? It was kind of mid. Your vlogs are better than mine. I agree with that. Um, you're better at Thank editing you. them, and uh, Thank you. and you, you have, you're you're more you have more personality in your vlogs, and I do have more of a dry wit, which comes across as boring. You can keep saying more positive things about me. <laughs> and you're prettier than me, so it's good to have you in the vlogs, so that people will thirst watch them. If people will try to fuck their guitar, then you have to think they'll thirst watch a vlog for you, right? I mean, if you can't- I'm not a guitar so If you can't be more desirable than a guitar, then there's a problem. Yeah, but I'm not, and I'm not <laughs> a guitar, so. That's true. <laughs> Tomorrow, we're heading to LA for uh, me to do Fat Mike's podcast, which means that tonight, we should do a little bit of packing, or at least, uh, at least you should. I can probably pack in 15 minutes. We're gonna time that, by the way. We're gonna time it? I don't even think it'll take me 15 minutes to pack. I think it'll take me like five. All right then, we shall see. Okay, well, let's go pack. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right, all right. Go. Some socks and underwear. We're only gonna be gone for uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Well, we're really only gone for one day, but I'm gonna bring three pairs in case I shit myself, you know, or in case something happens and there's skid marks and they <laughs> need to get replaced. You don't know. What's your outfit that you're gonna wear when you talk to Fat Mike? What's your most street cred, punk cred punk thing clothes? that you have? Maybe I'll wear some black pants. From what I understand, punk rockers wear black a lot. It's very not punk of you to wear Nike, so maybe just avoid wearing Nike, you know? That's true. I'll wear. Oh, but then people are gonna think you're a crip out there. You're cripping? So uh, we're flying into Burbank. Burbank? <laughs> you mean, how are you Kirk supposed King. to say that? <laughs> Whatever. Kirk King? Yeah. I feel like wearing band shirts to be interviewed with Fat Mike is too try hard. You know, it's like yes. wearing a band, like the band t-shirt of the band you're seeing. You're not supposed to do that. I agree. Most of the t-shirts I own are band shirts, not because I'm like a band shirt guy, but because I only buy them to wear in videos. Because he's a poser? Yes, because when I used to wear Nike shirts in videos, people would give me a hard time about it all the time. So I said, all right, fine. You guys told me I wasn't punk because I was wearing the wrong kind of shirt. This is uh, the Acacia Strain and Violent Gentleman. Nice piece. Thank you. I thought you were talking about my dick. What are you talking about? This is a family time. friendly vlog. And then I realized. And that, that is also so disturbing. <laughs> Why would you say that? I would I... never say that. <laughs> Those are all the clothes that I'm bringing. 13 minutes. All right, can I play Genshin Impact now? Yes. All right, we have departed. We are officially on the way to LA to see Fat Mike. I'm, I'm nervous, I'm scared, you know. Mike is a legend, and uh, after seeing how he broke under oath back in the day, I'm wondering, am I next? He's been super cool so far. I talked to him on the phone a couple times, super cool. I'm, I'm sure he's gonna be fine, but you know, I'm just worried this is all a setup. Is Fat Mike just luring me into his trap where he's gonna humiliate me for everyone? We will find out. Someone forgot their sunglasses, so he had to use mine and check them out because we're on some Prada shit. I feel like I'm in 18 Visions in 2005. I just need like a uh, pink swoopy hair in front of my eyes and like some Banana Republic button down shirt with a pink tie or something like that. We went to the appropriate restaurant. It's Poke for one, which is our favorite food, basically. And then this place is called Sweet Finn, which happens to describe that's, you. That's me. To a T. I'm Sweet Finn. Paper straw. Oh no, it's paper straws. Jesus Christ, maybe this place isn't so sweet after I'm all. I'm gonna throw myself in front of a bus before I drink out of a paper straw. Thank you for having me, I'm excited to be here. This is exciting for me. I spend so many nights uh, watching your your job, watching your show, your opinion. It's amazing. I'm flattered to hear that. I mean, I never would have thought I'd been sitting down with that mic. But I just, I just wrote you a note. I said, hey, you want to come do my broadcast? That's right. And you said, tell me when. That's do you right. live here? Do you live here in LA? No, in Seattle. Seattle, oh, oh shit. Seattle-ish. Yeah, so you just came down for this podcast? Yep. The DJ off. 
I invited no. you, and I changed my clothes because I don't want to look like a chat. <laughs> and they they tell me I still look like a chat. Maybe Motley Crue or this, or MGK. Oh, fuck! <laughs> <clears throat> Jesus Christ! They start recording at midnight. I mean, who does that? Someone in their twenties. He's got kids. What's he doing up staying up that late? He has kids. His daughter's like eleven. Ugh. Wow. My dad's Machine Gun Kelly. Oh, actually, that's a lot better than my dad's Fat Michael. Do we have enough Splenda? Twelve or thirteen, so just just barely enough. Just barely enough. Barely. For me, I just ordered a regular vanilla latte, and he was like, "Any kind of milk?" And I was like, "What?" It's like four or five different kinds of milk. Kind yeah, of milk and I was like, "Oh." They like ask, like they're conditioned to ask you about what kind of substitute milk you want. And I was just like, no, just regular we've, milk. He's like, oh my God, this person's reached... such a fucking pleb. <laughs> That's oh right. Oh my God, yeah. I can't believe this person drinks dairy. Feel God. Feel judging you. All right, we are on the way to see our good friend, Michael Montoya, AKA Morgoth Beats. I think our Uber is here. That's not a blue Uber. Or that's not a blue Prius yet. It's a black Prius. Oh, close enough. See, I don't even have my sunglasses on. Like, this is not my regular eyes. I'm squinting. It doesn't look that different, but like, I can tell, even I can tell that that's I'm, not a blue Prius. I'm still, I'm wearing these women's, what are these Prada? Women's Prada sunglasses yeah. all week. Even Prada can't cure your blindness. Hello. Hey! We didn't stage that. Welcome to my crib. Welcome to crib. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, dude? How are you? Good. Good to see you. Nice to see you. Hello, Hi, Lynn. Eddie, good nice to see you. Oh, yeah. What's up, buddy? Good to see you, man. Yeah. Oh, but that makes me think that they take off their shoes here, but they don't. Oh. No. Well, we're Asian, so. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> so, oh, you do? You take off shoes here? I mean, I don't I don't care if you do, but I do. I do. Right. It's fine, but. Post that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Post that. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah
maybe even a quarter. You have the Chaos and Carnage tour? Yeah, Chaos and Carnage. Yeah, yeah. What, who's on that one? That's uh, Carnifex, Lorna Shore, um, Angel Maker. Okay. I'm really excited about playing with them. Um, We're playing the West Coast, or the yeah. California. What's the flag will be playing? Oh, nice. Nice shows. The MySpace Deathcore meets TikTok Deathcore. Yeah, that's exactly. <laughs> brought together yeah. in a delicious it's sandwich. A little sandwich. Can you give me just a couple growls, like a couple lows, a couple highs real quick? On the they point and laugh, it might be cool if you did a little more staccato, like they point and laugh instead of they point and laugh. I point and laugh. I offer no Yeah, I think that's a little cooler. That felt, that felt good. All right, cool. Yeah, let's do a couple more like that. All right, so we just got done hanging out with uh, Michael Montoya and Eddie, watched them work on the Suicide Silence album. Very cool. I didn't realize they were actually like tracking shit today, so that was pretty cool we got a chance to do that. Um, and uh, yeah, the Fat Mike podcast was amazing too. I mean, I would have never in a million years thought that I would end up doing something with Fat Mike at any point in my life. Uh, I've been a fan of you know his band and of Fat Records for like 30 years now, pretty much. So that's definitely one of those experiences that I never ever thought I would have. And that is all you know because of YouTube, which is amazing. So. You know, first of all, thank you to everyone who watches my stuff and comes to my streams and all that stuff because you were the reason that it happened. And the, I, I guess, larger lesson to me is like, you gotta just put yourself out there. You know, I made that video about skate punk in 2017 or 2018, whatever it was, and he saw that and reached out to me and basically like that is how he knows who I am. And I had no idea that that video would be popular or that anything like this would ever come of it. And you know, you never know what's gonna happen. You never know who's watching. And, and I mean watching in the figurative sense, not just on YouTube, you know? So if you wanna work with somebody, send them an email or a DM. So we are, uh, a flight tomorrow morning is at like 5 a.m. So, or sorry, it's at 7 a.m. So we gotta get up at like five. Uh, not looking forward to that, but amazing trip so far. We did so much in two days i'm excited and uh not excited for tomorrow but yeah so far so good i didn't know what else to do so we had a couple hours to kill and i thought why don't we go to the lamest tourist trap mall so here we are but i will have it be known that i love normie tourist trap attractions like this are you enjoying yourself I've never been happier. Do you want to get some overpriced confection of some sort? I sure do. The only place I like more than this Oh, look at this giant Hot Topic. See? Holy shit. This is the biggest Hot Topic I've ever seen in my life. See? The wow. only place better than this is downtown Disney. I think this giant Hot Topic makes up for that. I think this hot giant Hot Topic is better than Disneyland. This wallpaper in our hotel is so inspiring. Rio Grande, that's uh, Brazil? Texas. What? It's the river between Texas and Mexico. It's not in Brazil? No. Oh. He's snuggling with her. That's cute. Oh. The silver tabby, right? Yes. Yeah. Yeah, I, I just wanted you to see. It's my camera. favorite kind of kitty. All right, guys. Log that for your Finn McKenty punk rock NBA trivia. We're at the airport. It's 6 a.m. For our 7 a.m. flight, we've got shitty, expensive coffee. Look how tired we look. Oh, I look tired. This is the kind of suffering that we endure to create content for you. I woke up like this, and that's not a good thing. Are you excited to go home? I am excited to be home. And have actually good coffee that's still expensive, but not fucking $5 for this. It's only $4. <laughs> We're tired. We'll see you in Seattle. Yeah. Hi! Did you miss us, baby? Yes. Oh, hi, baby. Ah. Uh...
Do you think she's happy to see us? Yeah. Oh, evidently not. She just walked away. I have to inspect. Where did you guys go? What other cats were you mingling with? Kitty, you have no right to be jealous. No, after all the yelling you've been doing. This trip was to get away from you, you little brat. There we have it. Hopefully you enjoyed watching the vlog. We have been home for a few hours, but traveling, even if it's for a short period, even if it's for fun, we both get kind of wiped out from it. And Finn had a lot of work to catch up on. So I figured I would uh, try to step in got some big shoes to fill and try to sign us off on this vlog. Hopefully you enjoyed watching. I don't exactly remember everything that Finn says in his outros, which is really awkward, but I do know that he thanks his patrons. He probably plugs his merch. He probably plugs his Twitch. If you're watching this, you probably already know all that stuff. Um, I guess we will see you in the next video. Peace out. Peace out.